price ranges from 600 pesos all the way to 1800. Yeah. Ah. Oh. Blessed with a beautiful sunset. No, I know it's the end, the end of the series, which I'm so sad about because I love Barakai so much now. Like, I fell in love here, man. I say, like, for me, Shargao is probably number one, El Nido would be number three, and then Barakai would be number two. Well, for today's game plan, uh, it's gonna be more chill day. I always tend to do that every time I travel. I tend to take the last day more relaxed. Before we get into it, I, I just wanna, like, recommend this resort. It's amazing, man. Like, price ranges from 600 pesos all the way to 1800 per person I need to give you a tour because I feel so strongly about this I already slept in this room that I'm in here's the clip from yesterday that I filmed before I messed everything up give you a quick tour of this standard native room so this is where I'm staying at friends hostel super solid price it's only like 1200 pesos for one night and it's good for two people so check this out all right so over here you got like a lounge area where you can just chill and then you go inside and I love this design, man. It's very simplistic. It makes me feel like I'm one with nature. And the best part has AC. And the bed is clean, the sheets are clean. And there's a small TV and a refrigerator if you want. There's a key to put where your locker is and stuff. And then a bathroom. So that's all you need for only 1200 in a very budget-friendly hostel. What else can you want, right? So that's a quick room tour of my room here at Friends Hostel. So for this part, this building is actually where all the family rooms are. The A-room, bedroom, dorm. So let's go in. Okay, over here, you can see there's three bedrooms downstairs. These eight bedroom dorms, family rooms, they all look the same. Yeah, you got a fan above, AC, and then you got a bathroom over there. It's pretty clean. It smells pretty good too. So that's how it looks downstairs. We go upstairs. There's five beds on the upper floor with AC as well and also with lockers. So, so for the dorm rooms, the eight bedroom that's per person is only 600 pesos. And then for the family room is 4,400 pesos. But if you divide that by eight, that only comes out to 550 pesos per person, which is super solid, grab a young bird shower, and it's nice. So let's see what else is here. All right, so I wanna show the basic native room next, but the thing is there's people on there right now, and so I can't show you, so here's a picture of that, with, and this place is only 1,200 per night, good for two packs already. Super worth it, has air conditioning. A few minutes later. So this is the entrance of Friends Resort and Hostel Barakai. So when you enter, on the left side, you got the bar, and then on the right side, you got the pool which is that aesthetic blue and then inside which is like the common room area which is the hangout you know where you eat and stuff like that that's kind of dark and then the receptionist is over there in the front right there if you can see that yeah they also serve breakfast here lunch dinner and on the right side over here there's actually the standard native rooms and then the deluxe rooms and uh, so this part is where I'm staying at the standard native room and then in this other buildings are the deluxe rooms. The basic native room is actually on the other building with the other dorms and stuff like that. So let's go to the other side where all the dorms are at, uh, the five bedroom dorm and the eight bedroom dorm. So right next to the reception, there's the, the dorm rooms over here on this side, the five bedroom dorms and then there's like the basic native rooms and then on this side is the eight bedroom dorm and the family rooms. It's pretty clean, pretty neat, right by the beach, three to five minute walk not too bad super cost friendly as well over here in this building on the left side facing the receptionist there are rooms here which is like the five bedroom dorms there are multiple rooms but there's five beds in each room if that makes sense so here you got the lockers over here and you got the five beds over here as well you have ac and it's only 600 pesos guys like that's so sweet to grab it all right guys so lastly let's check the deluxe room so this costs 1800 pesos so it's got a nice patio area where you could just chill then let's open the door oh it's so nice and cool oh look at that man yeah it's definitely like more luxurious than the rest than the standard native room the one i'm staying in yeah so you got the fridge over there tv you get your own big dresser over there the bed's nice for only 150 pesos more you can get the deluxe room which is also worth it i would go for that it's basically like you split with your partner that's like 900 pesos each in the bathroom over here too nice and clean so that's the whole room tours of friends hostels again 
again, shout out to Friends Hostel for being amazing. Shout out to Linus, shout out to Greg, shout out to Ate Alyssa, shout out to Robin. Shout out to the whole staff here. Everyone's so amazing here, man. All right, so let's go meet the gang. I think they're here at the Friends Hostel lobby too. So let's go see what the rest of the game plan is for today. All right, all right. All right, guys, so we're actually gonna try the Friends food here, the Friends Hostel food, and it's mad cheap, man. It doesn't go past 300 for the food here. I mean, there's like one or two dishes that cost like over 300. So if you wanna sulit your uh, budget again, get it here, Friends Hostel. They have everything, man. And then I'm with the squad right here. You got Mark. What's Yo. up, man? You got Zoe right here. You got Zar. Yes, sir. Zar is editing over there. Zar doing his thing. Zar is stressing. Yeah. stressing <laughs> and then where's Karina, bro? Oh, Karina's getting pampered in B Mall. If you don't know what B Mall is, I actually don't know what it stands for. District. District, District. Mall. Oh, okay. okay. That, that, I'm not sure. I'm just then good that. observation, <laughs> Zoe. Yeah, 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 I was gonna say something else, but it's inappropriate. Ah. Uh, so. Eh, nasty. Ah, <laughs> you nasty. You already know. You sick mind. <laughs> All right, guys. So the food just came in. And I ordered Tapsilog, which is only 180 pesos. Subtract that to the 10k budget. Yeah, taste test. Mm. Mm. Tapsilog is so juicy. And then the garlic rice is amazing, man. Mm. Highly recommend. Highly recommend. Oh, there's Karina. What's up? You got your nails did? You got your nails done? Wow, wow. Yo, Salzar. Later, Zoe. Bye, bye. Oh, I'll miss you guys. Guys, take care. We'll be great for you and Chow Gal. Yeah, okay, yeah. okay. Bye. <laughs> Zar and Zoe. This was actually their last day here. And I'll put their like channel over here, so make sure to subscribe to them and uh, hit that like button for them and all that good stuff. And I think the game plan is to go to the beach, get some photos. Yeah, let's just keep following what happens in this vlog. Okay, I see you, Mark. I see you with the braids. <laughs> oh, it's you wanted to get one, huh? No way. <laughs> I ended up getting one anyway. I was just what? like, you know what? Maybe. I should give it a go and see what it looks like. Uh, and then I seen it, I was like, actually, no, I don't want to go ahead. Uh, they wanted to go cover my whole head. And I was oh, like, really? No. <laughs> 50 pesos? It's okay, give it a go. Uh, is it worth it? Uh, Honestly? Uh, no. <laughs> Two hours later. Alright, we ready to race, Mark? Where are we racing? Let's race. Where are we racing? On three. Oh, yeah, there's Sigid and Arthur over there. See him? Yo, what's up? We missed you guys. We missed you, man. Where have you been? Yeah. Yeah. We're right, about to go. go touch that Bora water again for ready? the last time. Where are we? Alright, let's go. On three. Three, two, one, go. Oh, no. <laughs> 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 oh, 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 ah, 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 woo. Woo, man. Dude, the water feels amazing. Dude, it's not that salty actually. It feels so refreshing. Yo, how do you feel? I feel good. Yeah. And I was just thinking, when we come back to the Philippines, we need to uh, get all the vloggers together for La Baraka. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> if you don't know, La Baraka is like the big Baraka party, so. Next year, we're for sure gonna do that. The water temperature is so nice. The water is clear. Karina, how do you feel? Amazing. Yeah, how's the, how's the water feel for you? It's really nice. Yeah? It's like so clear. I can see my feet. Uh, what you can do here, you can rent one of those kite, those surfing kite, whatever boats. Yeah, like that one right there, you see that? You can just enjoy the sunset like that and enjoy it really close. <laughs> Beautiful, man. I'm on the right street. Amazing! But well, there's just so many people here. I feel alive. Like the sun just shining right there. Boracay though has one of the best sunsets I've seen. Like I said, I'll go back to my camera right now. We actually found the best shakes here in Boracay. The spot is called Beach Bomb Bar. Thank, Thank you, sir. The best dito, right? The best shakes. What do you think, Sigita? Thumbs up. Thumbs yeah. up. Amazing. I do like it. Wow. I do yeah. like it. You gotta try two or three. <laughs> I'm hating, I'm hating. <laughs> <laughs> like, Let's test this out. Mm. This is sweet, creamy, milky. Everything in the perfect shake. Wow, grab it. Really must recommend. Must recommend. So usually the mango shakes here is only 100 pesos. Kuya upgrade us to the melon mango shake, which is 150 pesos, but we only paid 100 pesos. Thank you, Benji. Thank, Thank you. you sir. Yeah. This is the best shake dito in Boracay, so try that out, okay? Then we're again blessed with a beautiful sunset. 
there are light rays shooting out that's like colored in pink and purple and then like at the bottom is like an orangey yellowish color yeah hands down i admit like for sure baraka has the best sunsets like it's not even it's a no contest arthur what do you think of the sunset man crazy crazy Intense, beautiful right wow what about you sugita it's dope <laughs> <laughs> it's dope <laughs> dang i didn't know sugita was a gangster barack i changed you what happened <laughs> life happens <Yeah. laughs> karina what do you think of the sunset incredible look at this so rays good to that like blue rays i don't know yeah it's I haven't seen something It's like amazing, that. wow. Definitely again one for the books. While wow, we enjoy this sunset and its beautiful rays, I think we're just gonna go back to Friends Hostel because there's actually an event going on, it's past the night, and then there's gonna be a DJ too, so let's go check that out. Alright, what's up guys? So we are back here at Friends Hostel. We're just gonna chill here because here at Friends Hostel there are like different events that happen. So today is gonna be a pasta night and live music and then uh, there's a DJ later on. Let's try this. Is it that one? Cheers, cheers. Super, super creamy. So only 99 pesos, so track that to the budget. Since it's the last night, we're gonna get another drink. So got the Adios MF right here. Cheers, 100 pesos only. That's strong. That's strong. No, bye guys. Bye. It was nice to meet you all. Take care, take care, take care. Bye. Go. Later. Let's go. <laughs> Again, that was Sagita and Arthur. They had to leave, but um, I'm gonna put their channel right here. I think right here. So make sure to subscribe to them. They're awesome people. Yo, so the DJ's here, man. Hey, yo. <laughs> yo. <laughs> so, unfortunately, Mark and Karina have to leave. No, you guys, I'm gonna miss you both, uh, man. It was such a pleasure meeting you both. All right, group hug, group hug, group hug. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh man, love you guys, love you guys. Uh, yeah, don't forget to subscribe to them, follow them, yeah, hit that like button for them. I'll post all their channels right here. Yeah, smash it, obliterate it, like obliterate it, <laughs> destroy it. Remember all the fun stuff in Bora, Bora all these yeah. things are flashing in my head right now with all the things that happened. Yeah, man. We've done yeah. a lot in that last three days yeah. with you, man. Bora was fun, man. It was yeah. an amazing experience. And I think we will definitely be back in Bora, whenever yeah. that would be. We might be in La Barakai. Yeah. La Barakai, yeah, man, back. next year. That's the party. We got a party yeah. for sure. We probably will see him before then anyway. Yeah, exactly. Uh, we do yeah. have plans to come back yeah. to the Philippines First, sooner. First of oh. many. First of many travels for sure. May not be in the Philippines. We might even see you somewhere else in the world. I know, I know. We'll Who knows? Who knows? Yeah. Hey, ooh, knows? Europe maybe. Who knows? Take it easy. Well, Love y'all. Love y'all. And then here are the final costs. By the way, with that said, I'm probably gonna end the vlog here. It's still partying over there at Friends Hostel. So I'm gonna visit there a little bit, stay and hang out. Hope you like the vlog. Hope you like the Barakai finale series. I really love this place and I can't wait to come back. And I think I already booked a flight in November. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, smash the thumbs up button. You know the drill. Love you guys. And then I'll see you in the next series, which is Behold. All right, I'll see you guys soon. Peace.